So here we are on episode nine of this flipping PC series. And the eight episodes before this, we have been $200 plus in profit on every single one. So we have made over $1,600 in profit. Hey guys, it's Chris with Tech Vibe, and today we are on episode nine of Flipping PCs Until We Can Buy Our Dream Car. And if you're not familiar with this series, we are trying to buy this vehicle right here. This is the DMC DeLorean made famous by the movie Back to the Future. Now, for those of you who don't know, this happens to be one of my favorite movies, something I grew up on watching, and I just absolutely loved this movie. It's one of my favorites, and I've wanted to own all of the memorabilia from this movie. And one day I will. Now, this car does cost around $50,000, and it's gonna be a tall order and a lot of PC flipping to get there, but we're doing pretty good so far and we are going to get there. It might take us a little bit, but we're gonna do it. Why? Because I want to. So for today's build, we are gonna be using a lot of newer parts and you know, that's really just because we got really good deals on them. Now we've got about nine AL Lee and Lee fans that we got for 120 bucks. All of these fans together, brand new, about $900, which is insane to say, I know, but that's the price that we got them, about 120 bucks. We have the Ryzen 7600X that we actually got in a pair with this RAM here. 32 gigabytes of Corsair Vengeance RAM DDR5. We got this for $180. Insane. If I still have the messages, I'll actually put it up here just so you guys can see. I, I got this for this much, which is insane. I had to get it. We've got a one terabyte M.2 that we spent 40 bucks on, 850 watt small form factor Corsair power supply that we had to buy brand new because of the case that we'll be using today. Spent $120 on that. We've got the Arctic liquid freezer that we got for, I wanna say $80. Really good, really good AIO. Wanted something that would do a great job on this CPU. For GPU, we are going with an older one. This is the ASUS 1080 Ti. Strix model and we are going with this because well I got it for free and free means more profit which you know we like so this is what we're going to be using for today's build and then we've got some cable combs here that we spent I think 20 bucks on actually and for our case the PA Le Resistance is the 011 Dynamic Mini black this is actually a case that I had that I'm not ever going to do anything with so this looked like a great opportunity to put all this in and make this look great. So this is kind of why I planned and tried to go after these fans when I did, just to make this all look as good as it can. And so I can charge a premium because we want profit. We want profit. We want profit, profit, profit. Now for the astute, you might be wondering, the motherboard, what are you using? Well, I'll tell you what we're using. We're using this right here the motherboard that i have in my main pc we're going to be taking out today because i got a different motherboard that's really nice an asus 7 something i don't know expensive that we're going to put in that one and take that one out and i actually got this motherboard for free but how'd you get it for free well the short version is that amazon goofed up and ended up uh, I got it for free from them because of something that they did that they weren't supposed to do that, you know, it just ended up working out in my favor. So I got that motherboard for free. It was like a 200 some dollar motherboard. I think it was, might have might been closer to 300 actually. Either way, it was free. So before we get started on today's build, I got to take apart my PC so we can use that motherboard in there for the build today. So let's do a little swappy. <clears throat> I know some of you might be wondering, how the heck do you get such good deals? Guys, I just find good deals. My formula is if someone tells me no, I just move on to the next one until I find a good one. I don't get hung up on people telling me no to whatever price it is I offer them. I could try to haggle a little bit if I'm willing to pay a little bit more, but most of the time, guys, I do really well really well and I think it just has a lot to do with me just being charismatic 
loyal, charming, or because I'm black and they're afraid to tell me no. I'm only half black, so joke's on them. Well, that came on first try, so that's good. I just uh, need all the pull. Oh, okay, it did. No boys. Let's go back to building then. All right, so computers together. I think uh, I think we're looking pretty dang good. I don't think you could beat a computer like this for 900 bucks, honestly, even if it's just a 1080 Ti coming with this thing. So let's get this thing tested, play some games, see what we're looking like. Gotcha. Ninja Banish! <laughs> oh, I need a better mouse for my testing setup, man. It's terrible. I hate this mouse so much.
After using the model O mouse and trying to use the knight sword, Jesus, it's the worst thing. I don't know how, what kind of load the GPU is under because for some reason it doesn't want to tell me, but I can see that the CPU is barely doing anything. God, this game is so terribly optimized. We're on medium and we're having that kind of trouble. All right, well, clearly this game is still not the one to go to. Literally just stab this girl one time. So after the testing, everything ran really good. I didn't expect it to not, considering it was a DDR5 system. But, you know, nonetheless, it still handled really good, even with us using not that great of a GPU for this time. I mean, it, this was an excellent GPU at the time that it came out you know so not not hating on the 1080 ti at all this is a strix version at that so this was the top that there was i mean there's a kingpin i guess you could argue that but this is among the top so this is a really good gpu for its time but it definitely did pretty good against a lot of these newer title games except for well arc ascension but that game is on a different that game's just different, so that, that thing's not optimized at all. Now, while I was doing testing, I actually had a buddy give me a call, and he's in the market for a PC, and I sent him some pictures. He's interested in this PC. He wants to get it, but he's going to go with a different route on the GPU side. He's going to actually pick up a 4070, so he's going to easily have a 4K system if he wants to go that route, but high settings everything this guy's going to have a really good system, so we're going to be selling this thing for 900 We spent a little less than 500 on this system i know we got really good deals on everything but you know this is probably our biggest profit yet on this system here so we're looking pretty dang gravy baby we're gonna get this thing packaged up because we actually have to send it to him he's paying for shipping nothing no skin off our back so we're gonna get this thing packaged up real good and we're gonna get it sent him to him so unfortunately i mishandled some of the videos and footage of me finishing packing up packaging up here taking this to the to the post office getting sent off and actually getting paid i accidentally deleted some of that uh sometimes it happens when you're doing content creation you can easily mess up and i just happen to do that but you can see the cost breakdown what we made what we spent and not a bad profit for this one guys you know this is our biggest profit yet there were a lot of parts that we were able to add in that we didn't have to pay for uh and definitely help with the profits but hey profits profit doesn't matter where it comes from so we're gonna keep moving on on to the next video